Thank you. All right. Well, we're getting down to the nitty gritty here. We're going to go green with 12 laps to go. It's all or nothing now. The winner seals the last spot for the Nortona 500. Everybody else going to go on an alternate list. Those alternates should be around and present tomorrow in case somebody does not show, which is very possible. Last year, I think we had uh, two. Did not show for the 500 last minute. And uh, that is actually how uh, uh, Dustin Lee, who was an alternate, ended up winning the whole thing. Yeah, 10 4 oh, there, Bizarco. I'm going to look into that when we're done here. Don't want this happening tomorrow. That's for sure. Pace car is off. Green flag racing. Here we go. Green flag. Green, green, green. They're going three wide off the start. Nope. Back to double. Forty-one on the outside, getting pushed by Monsel there. Go ahead, Robert. I got with you, Dan. That's Boobs up front, down to the bottom. Whoa! And Monsel tries to sneak in there, and Peck not going to let him. A lot of bumping going on, coming through the tri oval. Eleven to go. Oh, July 88. And there they go again. I hope we can hang on for 10 more laps to see the finish in this race, but uh, buffering, resources being sucked up. Munsell on the outside. Ten to go. Munsell actually uh, looks like he's got the advantage here on the outside. Wilms at the 12. I guarantee you when it comes down to two, somebody's going to push somebody out of the way. Look at Ducharme on the outside trying to make it. That high lane work all by himself, but he's got no help whatsoever. More buffering on Twitch. I hope you guys still can see the feed. I'm going to continue to talk, whether you can or not. bottom yeah maybe a full moon tonight that may be causing some uh, lunar interruption I don't know Monsel on the outside he's got the edge Wilms looking for a hole eight laps to go and we're gonna lose the feed you guys still seeing this? Three wide down the back stretch. Ducharme needs some help.
three wide out of four. All right, good, good. Having all kinds of issues here. Still seven laps to go, and Boob still out front, down on the bottom, with Peck there in the 59, right behind him. Munsell on the outside, as well as Wilms there in the 12. Cheetos, man, has had a rough week, and he wants to be able to get to the front. Only got a lead, one lap, and that's the last one. Mark Newland also having a rough week. He's going to bring his 96 guard down pit road now. He's pretty much going to be done for the night. Driver showing a lot of patience right now. Oh, no, they're not. I spoke too soon. Ducharme in the uh, GM Goodrich car. And they're three wide down the back stretch. No yellow yet. These guys are going to race until they see the yellow. Three wide for second place. There is the yellow. And I still, I think they will have enough time for one restart. I thought that last race, though. Let's hear the driver communication. I'm sure they're bitching up a storm. Okay. If it were to end right now, Brian O'Shell would be in the show. But we'll see what the pace car is going to do. There may be a one lap shootout. I thought that last race, but. Thank you, man. Can't hear any of the drivers' blurbled, garbled communication. Drivers still going to look for the best finish they can to be high up on that alternate list. I actually see some guys coming down pit road with five to go. Richard Allen on pit road, Newland on pit road, Simmons is off. Simmons getting caught in that wreck. Let's go back one lap. at the bottom of your screen. 20 driving uh, Kevin Harvick scheme there. Thank you. See communications very garbled. This is coming down the back stretch and 20 comes way up the line. Simmons into Descharmes and 
Ducharme Speed Weeks are officially over. Will not make the 500. Back up live. Uh, I think we're going to see a shootout to yep. the end. Hoping they double up this time. We get to see three laps. Watch the pace car, folks. The pace car will tell the story. Uh, lights are still on. Yeah, lights on the pace car are on. If they double up next time, that'll be two to go. And then they'll go green with one lap remaining. One lap shootout. Uh -huh. Two and a half miles to decide it. Yep, we are going to have a one lap, well, let's see. If the lights go out on the pace car, this lap, we'll have a one lap shootout. If they do not, the race will be over. Unless one of these guys runs out of gas or can't finish for whatever reason. Let's watch the pace car again. They do go out. We are going to have a one lap shootout, folks, to the end. They will be taking the green on the white to the checker. It's not a green white checker, it's green on the white to the checker, is what's going to happen here. Everybody's going to race, and there is going to be a lot of pushing and shoving, and I guarantee you somebody's going to get spun around for one lap. Hope you guys are still seeing the feed. You're going to see the most intense last lap here. Live on Norgar TV from all of the Speed Weeks. Speed Week races. Um, desperation is here. No, no, Chance, uh, one of the racers who did qualify, just for the, to, let's clarify the explanation. One of the racers that did qualify entered the last heat race and was DQ'd. So his spot opened up. So the winner of this race will seal the last spot. Positions two on the back, names will be the alternates. Position two will be the first alternate, position three will be the second, and so on and so forth, down the line. Pace car gonna dump it, here we go, last lap. Last lap to end the Nord Tona 500 Speed Weeks. Here we go, 2014, can't see anything. There we go. And Boob's gonna lead him down. Peck on the outside.
Side by side is Peck and Boobs. Here comes Munsell. Remember, they can push here on this lap, and they're going to push through the turns for sure. Coming out of three and four, who's going to make a move? Munsell trying to get by, and Boobs is going to win it. Wreck it coming across the line. Three wide for about fifth. O'Shell wins it and seals the last spot. Way to go, dude. Awesome. Yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah. Good job, boo. 10-4, thank you. Good, good win, boo. Woo! 41. Oh no, Boobs got wrecked on the checkers. We'll try to get a word in with Boobs, but uh, everybody else. Munsell will be the first runner up. Cormier going to be second. Peck third. Wilms fourth. Stuart Redmond in fifth. Eckhart Jr. sixth. Oh my God, thank you, Munsell. Thank you. Hammer in seventh. Edwards Jr. Yeah, in eighth. Ninth is going to be Simmons. Reber in tenth. And Ducharme going to be eleventh. That's what I'm talking about, boobs. I appreciate it, Brantley. Appreciate it, bud. I don't know if I can talk to him. Having so many issues here. Let's see if we can get a word in with the winner. Boobs, you got the last spot. How do you feel? Woo! I told you I was going to win this shit. I told you. No, you told me you were going to win the last one. But you ended up winning it anyway here. So, uh, good job, man. Congratulations. How do you feel? Man, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm happy, dude. I can't even uh, explain. I got to thank Munsell for pushing me there to the end. Um, everybody, man. Just got to thank everybody. Well, how good's your car? What do you got for 500 miles here at Daytona tomorrow? i tell you what I got. I got the wind coming. I got the trophy coming. Oh, man, I just... I'm, I'm so pumped right now. I'm ready to do this. I got to thank everybody at Norgard TV. I got to thank you guys. I thank Bobby, Matt. I got to thank Eric Brantley. I got to thank, I mean, everybody, man. I got I to gotta thank all of you guys. Well, congratulations, man. Uh, good job and good luck tomorrow. Thank you, brother, and happy late birthday. Thank you. Oh, well, thank you very much. Yeah.